Hong Kong has marked the anniversary of the handover with Chief Executive John Lee declaring that the city is now driving at full speed down the fast lane of recovery. But he warned against destructive forces who use what he called soft resistance. Chief Executive John Lee led current and former officials at the flag-raising ceremony at Golden Bohemia Square this morning to mark the 26th anniversary of Hong Kong's return to Chinese rule. Also attending were his predecessors, Lim Chengging, Carrie Lam and Donna Zhang. Liaison Office Director Zheng Yanxiong and Liu Guangyuan, Commissioner of the Foreign Affairs Ministry in Hong Kong. A reception followed at the Convention and Exhibition Center next door. In his keynote speech, Li referred to last year's visit to Hong Kong by President Xi Jinping. Li said Xi's four musts and four proposals served as the basis of his governance. The chief executive hailed the progress made on the social, political and economic fronts over the past year and Hong Kong's exit from recession in the first quarter. He said his administration led Hong Kong out of the darkness of the epidemic, and the city is now driving down the fast lane of recovery at full speed, with the resumption of travel to and from the mainland. But Lee warned that destructive forces using soft resistance means are still lurking in the city. We must stay vigilant and be proactive in safeguarding national security, he said. Like Xi last year, the chief executive wrapped up his speech with an ancient Chinese saying, those who work will succeed, and those who walk will arrive at their destination.